I'm Rod Trent, Senior Cloud Security Advocate with Microsoft and a correspondent for the Security News Now news team. Here's what's happening now for Azure Sentinel. Today at Microsoft Ignite, we heard that Azure Sentinel has been rebranded to Microsoft Sentinel. Microsoft Sentinel, the Microsoft Cloud Native Security Information and Event Management Security Tool, helps organizations optimize security operations through artificial intelligence and automation. To aid overworked security operations teams, significant updates have been made to Microsoft Sentinel across the full security operations lifecycle. Some of the most significant updates in preview include more than 100 solutions in data collection in a new content hub for easy delivery and deployment of data sources. Also, additional user behavior analytics detection models have been supplied to help identify threats based on behavioral anomalies. These can be customized using new watch list templates to provide insights relevant to the organization. In addition, expanded fusion technology can help identify unknowns and correlate them with existing inputs to generate prioritized inputs for more rapid investigation. Enhancements have been included using Microsoft Azure Synapse to tap into the limitless power of big data analytics and machine learning models. Also, of interest, near real-time analytics rules, tuning recommendations, and streamlined management and deployment of rules from GitHub and Azure DevOps repositories have been added to improve the efficiency of the Security Operations Center. Users wishing to explore Microsoft Sentinel can now take advantage of a new 30-day, 10 gigabytes per day free trial to experience these updates. By the way, look for our new news show called Security News Now, a weekly news show to consolidate and curate weekly updates to help keep customers up to date on new features and enhancements, much like being reported today. The programming schedule will be available soon, so stay tuned for announcements. I'm Rod Trent, and that's what's happening now.